right? It's a positive delta T. While we're on this topic, bend your mind around this. What if I have a thing that's insulated and that the temper the heat flow is zero? Let's do this and let's compress the cylinder. Let's go minus 45, right? I compress the cylinder. In other words, I do work on the cylinder. It doesn't do work on me, but I do work on it. What has to happen to the internal energy? Yeah, it's got to be plus 45. Now, here's the question. How can you heat? I understand how I can heat a gas by putting it on the stove and letting heat flow into it. How does a piston make the gas hotter? Now, there's no fuel in here. I'm just pushing the piston down. I'll show you this. I'm going to light something on fire by pushing a piston down. How does that physically make a gas hotter? No, without friction, it would do it. How does it make them jump around faster? No. There's not a, making less room won't make them. You don't know. No, I do know. Think about that wall. We're inside the piston. Let's put ourselves in the piston, in the cylinder. Are you picturing this? That wall is the piston. It's moving toward us, right? If I have a perfectly elastic collision, if I bounce a ball off the wall when it's sitting still, it bounces off with the same speed and comes back to me. If it's moving toward me, it bounces off with a faster speed. Isn't faster hotter? Yeah, there we go, right? Okay, so it's like a ping pong ball slam, like you, you slam the paddle into the ball, it comes off the paddle faster, yes? Then it came to you. That's how, it, that's how it heats it up. What if we expand it? What if the wall moves away from us? It's going to be slower, it's going to be cooler, right? So this is how refrigerators make a hot side and a cold side. Uh, volume. Yeah, I know, you do, don't get your mind stuck on um, ideal gas law, right, or something like that, right? That just tells you, if you know all those things, it tells you what the other thing is, but it doesn't tell you what happens if you change something, right? So if I compress it and I change the volume, well, then it might be at a different temperature, right? It could be. Okay, let's have you guys try these. Ben? Der done that. Ben, der done that. So here's all you got.